Hello, my name is Gabe Zona. On the Today Show, Matt Lowry uh, interviewed one of the wives of uh, the ex-Navy SEALs that was murdered in Benghazi. And what he asked her was, uh, what is it that you would like your children to remember about their father? And I like to quote her, and what she said uh, was his love for Christ. And then she continued by saying a number of other comments as well that she would like her children to remember their father by. And what's really, I think, somewhat disgusting is that um, when uh, on the MSN's homepage, that's uh, MSNBC, they replayed that story, but they left out some key words, and they left out his love for Christ. Now, the reason that they say they left it out when they were questioned is because they didn't want to offend any particular group of people. Well, uh, why is it okay that uh, the name or the reference to God or to Christ is pretty much taken out of anything and everything that they can? Yet, uh, they're trying to now pass laws, and they have passed laws in certain countries, and I think it'll eventually be here as well, whereby if anybody insults or says anything negative about the Prophet Muhammad, they can be severely punished, if not even executed, I'm sure, in some countries. You think there's something wrong with this picture? I sure do. I think... As each day goes by, we're drifting further and further away from what built this country. We're drifting further, further away, and we're going to end up in a very, very dark, bad place. Is it too late to stop what's happening? I don't know. Um, I don't know if anyone knows. What I do know is that we have a Congress that is absolutely... 100% worthless. They have done nothing to protect the American people these last four years, and I see them doing nothing to protect the American people as we move into the next four years. They will sit back idly. They will make their millions. They will continue to protect themselves with their laws that protect them. They're the lawmakers, remember. And what do we get for it? what we've gotten for it. Nothing. You think we need a change? I think we needed a change a long time ago. We've got to get rid of the dead wood. We have to get rid of the senators and congressmen that have made a career out of being in Washington. We have to have them work for us, not we work for them. We have become their slaves. And with Obama's taxation plans, we're going to continue being their slaves. God help America.